Hi everyone, this is Josh with Josh Wright Piano TV. Before today's episode, I wanted to announce the three latest videos from the VIP Masterclass series, a series all about making custom videos for members uh, based on their specific requests. Um, the last three weeks, uh, on April 9th, I recorded a video called Strategies for Effective Dynamics and Beautiful Playing While Using Metronome. That was dedicated to Brian. On April 16th, uh, how to make an arrangement of an existing composition, and I included the free sheet music with that, um, including how to alter chord progressions, how to embellish and expand harmonies, and how to write introductions and conclusions. That was requested by Daniel. And the week of April 23rd, um, I went over tips for Bach fugues, including form, dynamics, fingering, and articulation, and demonstrations came from the Bach fugue in B-flat major, Well-Tempered Clavier 1, requested by Michael. So if you'd like to become a member, just click on the link below. Now on to today's video, which is dedicated to my sister, Savannah, who has been playing this semester um, this Tariello Toccata. Uh, if you want to look up the music, it's T-A-U-R-I-E-L-L-O. Um, really fun 20th century piece. Um, let's see. passage in this that is a total pain in the butt. So it's it goes like this. Let's see. I always tend to mess up at the end there. I don't play this. I've just taught it to her and then one other student this semester, so I've had to demonstrate this a lot. Um, okay, now faster. have to work out that end um, but I have a lot of videos on accuracy and jumps I discovered something new that will hopefully help each of you so in the um, free hands videos I talk about releasing into like no tension and then in the up down exercise video which really helps with jumps I talk about up down up down up down and you kind of come back and then you go back down really fast throw your hand in the next position because what most people do is they play up and then they get back down slowly and so when they're in a fast tempo they have to end up chopping at the keys they go and then it's a mess okay the piece of advice that I want to give you today is to pull your hand a little bit towards um, the in the direction that you're going so for instance like almost like flipping it here and then coming down. So down, up, down. See, I'm kind of like going like this a little bit, but then I straighten back out as soon as I get to those keys. But if you go like this and say, fling your hand to the side, it's a very natural motion. Now keep your hand straight on. It's a much less natural motion to do this versus that, you know, cause we're used to like swatting things away. It's just like a natural human, um, movement, you know, you can swat something like if a like a bug is coming at you, you swat it w away like that. You don't go, you know, <laughs> like really awkwardly like that. So, um, okay, now a little faster. Okay, now faster. Because if we're So it's just a little tip to use the natural movement when you're doing large leaps uh, rather than keeping your hands straight on. If any of you have any questions, uh, please feel free to send me an email. My email is josh at joshwrightpiano.com. If you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, um, you're going to see a couple videos. If you want to keep watching, come up here. Subscribe button down here. And then if you want to visit my website for a complete list of videos, um, you can also check out the VIP Masterclass series on my website up there. Um, and I hope all of you have a great week. Good luck in your practicing.